Uh, I play one of the bad guys, one of the bullies. He's the bully of the high school. He's kind of the, the, the tough guy of the group, but he also has a soft spot. He's kind of the voice of reason for the group of guys. We're bullying Kelly. Uh, he's, the, he's the main victim. But let's just say he, he comes back with a vengeance. And the, vengeance, and the vengeance isn't pretty at all for any of us. I think he does it because he's been hurt for so long. It comes to a tipping point where it's time to change things. So he gains these powers and that's like the sci-fi aspect of the movie where in the supernatural, is, it's crazy. Like, you know, we, we do things like normal people. We go to the lake, have barbecues. We, we spend a lot of time in, in, in the truck, in the pickup truck where a lot of bad things go. You know, I feel like I feel like that's what happens in a lot of schools today. Kids get bullied, which is not good. That encourages or or influences them to do things that are ten times worse than what they've they've been going through. I love how they intertwine like the sci-fi and, and the normality of the world in one film because bullying is something that kids deal with all around the world. But it's an interesting take because it gives the kid who's dealt with it power. You know, it's not just, oh, we bullied this kid and he's trash and he'll never figure out life ever again. It's like, no, we're gonna show you a kid who's gone through so much, who actually turns and gets gains the power that he's been dealt with all his life. And you get to see what he does with it. You're a fan of Kelly's. You want Kelly to win throughout the entire film. You see what he's dealt with. But, you know, you also see Kelly grew up hard he was dealt with a lot it's a great piece to show people not great things can come out of bullying and not great things can come out of a kid who has been bullied with power fuck out of here